Well, we're, you know, we're sort of competitors. Um, if there are any business, well, yeah, we did Titanic with them. We were partners in Titanic. Uh, but we don't have an ongoing strong business relationship with him. I see him frequently. I met with him and John Dolgen and Michael Eisner only a few weeks ago to discuss all kinds of problems, including encryption of our product. Uh, I like them. I was curious to think of such giants, if you'll forgive that term, uh, as you and Rupert Murdoch and the others who uh, uh, have come to occupy so much of the space in our business. Are any of you so big that you can't be bought out by the others? Well, in the first place, you can't buy Viacom out because I control it. I'm the only one who literally has absolutely the absolute control of the company. So certainly a buyout against my wishes could not occur. I don't think it's a matter of size, though. Uh, Rupert, I guess, has effective control because of the percentage of the stock he owns. But would you but I'm have not a, interested in being bought out. I'm interested in going ahead. Well, would you be interested in buying well, well, News Corp? Well, no. No, you know, one studio is enough. It's hard enough to make good pictures. Uh, and if we had two studios, we still wouldn't try to make more than 17 or 18 pictures a year. No, we're not interested in that kind of, uh, of acquisition. I used to say, as we did each deal, this is it. It's over. <laughs> But I've learned from living with myself that it's never over. 